Well, how bad are the potholes right now? They are awful. You drive into work. We are driving through Midlothian here, and you're you're zipping around the mall to get here. I think <laughs> everybody's got a story. Yeah. I put them into three categories. You've hit one, dodged one, and hopefully you haven't landed in one. Right, because that can be expensive, not only for drivers, but also for communities. 27 First News reporter Miriam Hobbs explains how communities are trying to fix them. Whether in Bortman Township or Youngstown, potholes appear to have taken over the roads and drivers are frustrated. The potholes, they're terrible. Carl Hardy of Youngstown says he's torn up tires and dented rims driving through potholes everywhere he goes. I didn't ruin quite a few tires. Coming up the street, I had to go pretty slow. They're very bad at, right now. Winter's been a little hard on the roads. Tom Sackmar of the Youngstown Street Department says their phones have been ringing nonstop with pothole complaints. Crews were out patching up potholes all day. He says the below freezing temperatures are to blame. The freeze thaw, you know, we had to deep freeze and kind of push, you know, freezes underneath, pushes up, and then as it thaws, then they just pop loose because of moisture underneath. Drivers continue to swerve to dodge the potholes, and the turning lane has become the most traveled lane on most roads. The Mahoney County engineers are aware of how tough potholes can be on vehicles and are advising drivers to be careful. They also have a number of crews out patching potholes. I'm just asking everyone to please slow it down a little bit if you can. Be careful. The potholes right now are filling up with water because of the melt. You can't see them. The Youngstown Street Department has received deliveries for thousands of pounds of cold mix. Crews will be out tonight as well as over the weekend filling potholes. Reporting in Youngstown, I'm Miriam Hobbs for WKBN 27 First News.